Okay, so I am making a living doll. And I have a living doll um, flesh tone clay. I have my acrylic roller. I have my mold. And I conditioned this clay already so it's nice and soft. And I'll show you what I'm going to do. I'm going to roll it. And now I'm just going to fill the cavity. Okay, push it all the way in. See, I'm pushing it into the cavity. <clears throat> Make sure it's evenly distributed in there so you can get every detail. Okay, I'm going to take my acrylic roller. See, because it's all lumpy, and I'm going to roll it out. Okay. <clears throat> you just have to play with it. Make sure it's not overlapping in some areas. Okay. So it should look like this. See? It doesn't look much like that. Now, when you release it, you have to go very, very carefully because the head, all the details on the face will get all messed up. So you want to open it up like this first, see? And you want to pop him out. You don't want his head to be messed up. Anything else you can smooth out. Eh, gotta go nice and easy. Because this is so detailed, you don't want to mess it up. Okay. See, the head got a little mushed, but this is the baby. Look. It, that's a sleeping little baby. And you can tell, look at the butt. Look at the toes. How cool, right? So I would definitely have to take out a little mark on the back. So I'd have to definitely smooth that out. And then um, tint it with colors so it looks like real like make shadows on it so it looks like a real baby sleeping. And then I'm going to make maybe like a, a little hat or um, a nice pair of wings. And yeah, how cute is that? Hope you enjoy my video. I'm gonna go bake him. Well, I'm gonna fix him up, color him up, and, um, and put him in the oven. All right, guys, hope you enjoyed this. Bye.